everybody welcome back to my channel my name is Jessie and if you're new here I unbox subscription boxes and more today is the and more part I have another set of crystals to show you from the amazing company captivating crystals uh, they have a Valentine's Day set out right now and, and I also got some extra uh, crystals that they sent me for free to show me for you guys to review so if you'd like to see what's in this beautiful candy like Valentine's Day container and see the gorgeous crystals, then please stay tuned. Right, everybody, so this is what the uh, box looks like inside. Again, I want to thank Captivating Crystals. Um, I did pay for this box at a discounted price, 20% um, off from my last purchase, and I did get these additional crystals for free to review and show you guys. Um, but they're, the, they're a new up-and-coming crystal company. I will put their website and Instagram down below. I highly recommend following them on Instagram. They do a lot of updates, um, and you can also, of course, keep checking their website. They're going to eventually be doing crystal subscription boxes. Basically, everything came, each individual crystal was wrapped up very nicely in bubble wrap and labeled with a piece of tape. Um, I'm going from confidence. I know what they are at this point, and I just wanted to show you what they look like, but they were wrapped very well. I always have to say their packaging is absolutely stunning and 100% done well. I've never, I've ordered twice now from them and have not had a problem with the crystal. Um, so let's get inside this box. I also, I love the fact that they included a little uh, milk chocolate heart. I can't wait to eat this. Uh, it's by the brain uh, brand Caffarel. So there's that. Uh, so let's get this. Let's get this box a little bit closer here. All right. So I will say that it's it's a very cute candy like tin. It's not the most sturdy tin. Um, if you move it around a little bit, they do fall out. But it's a really cute setup. I really love the way that everything was done. Um, so I want to show you guys this first one is rose quartz and it's actually in the shape of a gummy bear I don't know if you guys can see that but yes, it's in a rose quartz gummy bear It's very cute. It looks like that side is washing it out I'm using different lighting today. I'm hoping this works out well So yeah, this rose quartz gummy bear. I think it was made ex it was ex an exclusive for the Valentine's Day box and basically, it's rose quartz is also known as the love stone because of its properties to attract love, self-love, self-worth, and healing from past lovers. This limited edition rose quartz gummy bear is beautiful and unique and is filled with tons of energy. They sent a nice um, description of each of the crystals uh, in the Valentine's Day set, which I really appreciate. Uh, so that's awesome. All right, I moved my lighting back around a little bit. Hopefully you can see this better now. Uh, but there's the rose quartz gummy bear. So the next one, these are very slippery by the way. The next one at the top is opalite. I actually, I just love opalite. It's a very shiny iridescent type crystal. Uh, it's got tons of rainbows on my end. I hope you guys can see this in the camera. Um, opalite, it's just, it's very smooth. It's a very fun stone to handle. I really, really, really love it. And I'll read you about opalite. Opalite, although this is man-made, it is filled with tons of energy. It helps stabilize mood swings, helps in overcoming fatigue and activities of the third eye chakra, which help, oh sorry, it activates the third eye chakra, which helps increase psychic abilities. Very cool. So again, that would be the opalite. Very, very, very pretty. Uh, moving right along next is the Jasper. And it's in a heart shape. And the only thing I don't like about this is they, they labeled it, but they didn't label. There are tons of different types of Jasper. And um, this isn't labeled, and I'm actually not sure which type of Jasper it is. Although, I mean, it could be polychrome Jasper, but most of the polychromes I've had in the past have had, like, reds and oranges in them. Uh, this one, although, I, I love it. It's really different, and I guess there is some orange, so it could be polychrome chrome jasper. 
So, Captivating Crystals, if you're watching this, please um, let me know what this is. But I, I, it could be very well. I, I, it might just be polychrome, but I love it. I love Jasper Hearts. They're, they're one of my favorite crystals for sure. Um, and let's see, I have a bunch of Jasper. And the set um, sheet says for Jasper, Wear or carry Jasper to alleviate stress and induce tranquility. Its cleansing effect eliminates negative energy and stabilizes one's aura. I totally feel that. I, just looking at Jasper, I think it's because it's so patterned and unique. It's just a very relaxing crystal. It's just really nice. Really nice to see all the swirls and the patterns and everything. Um, so down here we have a clear quartz sphere. And you know how I love spheres. Uh, I would say palm stones are my favorite, followed by towers, quickly followed, closely followed by spheres. You know me, I like all crystals. This clear quartz is really pretty. Clear quartz is known for rainbows. I don't know if I move it around enough if you guys can see any rainbows. But it's a really nice, really nice specimen too. I really like the quality of clear quartz. And the sheet says for clear quartz, it is great for amplifying any energy slash intention and protecting against negativity and attuning to one's higher self. So that's awesome. And the last one in the box is called a Botswana agate. And I knew it was a type of agate. I just wasn't entirely sure. Uh, so Botswana is very cool. And look at the swirls on this. This is this one's really pretty too. This is also kind of relaxing to me like um, the Jasper is. And you know, in some ways it almost looks like Chevron Amethyst. It's amazing how much these crystals can look alike yet are they're different. So I'm just trying to give you guys all angles because you know you want to see everything and experience everything at all angles. But look at that swirl. Is that in focus? Oh, I hope that's in focus. Maybe it'll focus over here. There we go. Woo! Pretty, pretty stone. So let's read about the Botswana agate. It's a crystal of possibility and hope. I need that right now. It helps with artistic expression and exploration of the unknown. A comfort stone, beneficial in overcoming depression and strengthening during a grieving process. That sounds like a really nice stone to have. Um, I really like it. I really like this Valentine's Day set in general. I think it's a really nice quality. I'll leave the price down below. I can't remember what the full price was because I, I did get a 20% discount from my last purchase which I am very grateful for. Um, so yeah, let me know what you guys think of this set. It was, tw I wanna say it was like 28, but I'll definitely put it in the screen in the description box. Um, and then I got it for 20% off, which was fantastic. And you guys, they ship really quick. So I'm filming this on February 8th and they still have eight left. So I'm really hoping that you guys can maybe still get one of these. I'm hoping to get this up on my channel as soon as I can. Um, but they also, I contacted the company today before I filmed and the owner said that, you know, they would sell them until they are out of stock. So if you, ha if you want to, let's say, buy one um, after Valentine's Day even, or if it gets creeps up to be Thursday, you know, you won't get it in time for Valentine's Day, but you could still get it and um, that would be super cool. And even if they have any left after Valentine's Day, they might sell some as well then. So it's really just until it's out of stock. And last I looked, there were eight left. Um, and then you could negotiate with the company after that. Um, but I'm going to move on to uh, the pieces that they sent me for free to review with this box that I paid for. Uh, I'm very grateful to them. I love that they keep sending me crystals to show you guys because I don't know what's in there at all. And I'm excited and I really can't wait to see. All right, so from remember from my past video, this company, Captivating Crystals, has single crystals for sale as well as sets, uh, the sets like the Valentine's Day set special, or they have sets that manifest different things like love or money um, or other, other things that you would want to manifest. So I got three additional pieces for free that I'm really excited about. I got the product cards. You guys know the box comes with tons of these like gold squigglies that I just love putting out on my display. Uh, so I want to get inside and show you, but I just wanted to show you like how well these are all wrapped and as usually like you've got the little label on them, which I love. Uh, so I'm excited. Let's get in here. 
All right, so I know the company had a lot of cool things on their website right now. They've got some bracelets, they've got towers. I know they've got some really cool soda light pieces. And what they sent me today was actually a piece of raw halite, uh, some raw citrine, which is really pretty, and I'll go into more details. And um, this is, they're calling this crystal quartz. So I'm gonna start with the crystal quartz because I'm, I'll admit I'm a little curious. I'm wondering what the difference, uh, this was labeled in the Valentine's Day box as clear quartz. And to me, they look fairly similar. Uh, I don't know about you guys. If anybody out there knows if there's a difference between clear quartz and crystal quartz, please let me know in the description box below. Um, so yeah, I really like, I mean, it's still really pretty. Uh, so let's read about the properties of the crystal quartz. It did come in this nice little black baggie with the uh, golden um, squigglies. But here's the, I love the product cards too, by the way, that comes with the crystals. So crystal quartz, one of the most versatile, powerful healing crystal. Great for amplifying and any energy or intention, protecting against negativity and attuning to one's higher self when next to higher self. When next to other crystals, it can amplify and intensify the energy of the other crystals. <laughs> That's funny. That kind of reminds me of the frankincense essential oil. Totally off topic, but frankincense oil is also known to amplify the powers and um, chemical abilities of the other essential oils. So I find that fascinating. Um, moving along, the crystal quartz can also be used to cleanse and purify oneself and other crystals. Helps to get rid of negative negativity and any negative energy. Use this crystal when working and manifestation. Wow, I cannot read. I need to turn my backlight on. Um, use this crystal when working with manifestation and intentions to amplify your goals. So that's really, really cool. It sounds like I should be using this during meditation. Um, if you guys watched my last video uh, about the Mime Wander self-love box, you would see that a lot of these crystals would be very perfect for the um, the, the creativity uh, self-love kit. The compassion kit is what it was called, I think, that went into that be, be beautiful pouch. I remember I mentioned putting in crystals. I would definitely put in some clear quartz. Um, I would also put in, oh boy, it's going to roll away. There we go. I would also put in some rose quartz for sure. Um, even the jasper. I mean, a lot of these have great intentions and great things. So I would definitely, these, these crystals actually would be a good size too for that pouch. Um, so let me move on. Now this piece of citrine is just amazing. I think this is the most beautiful citrine I've ever seen. It kind of, it almost looks like amethyst, or not, what am I saying? It, it's, um, it does look like amethyst, I mean, in its raw form, but the color is very amber-like. I guess I've only, I, when you think of raw crystals, I guess amethyst is the most popular. But citrine is just so beautiful. And this is just such a gorgeous piece of, piece of it, and then look at the bottom. You can see where it was taken out of the rock. So let's read about the properties of citrine. And we had a nice yellow product card here. Citrine, also known as the merchant stone, for its properties of manifestation, attracting abundance, wealth, success, generosity, dispelling built up anger and good fortune. It says good fortunate, but I think that means should be good fortune. Uh, I think there might be a typo here, but that's fine. Uh, good for carrying in one's pocket or bag while dealing with business, as well as to attract money. Helps balance the solar plexus chakra, as well as increasing self-confidence and esteem. Great crystal for manifesting love and happiness in any relationship, prosperity, and good luck. So that's awesome. That's another good one for Valentine's Day, manifesting love and all that. Um, I like the different properties of the crystals. I think it's really fascinating. I really, really like the citrine. Uh, so now let's move on to the Howlite. This is also in raw form. I've actually never seen Howlite in raw form. So I'm pretty, it's pretty cool. It's a little bit almost chalky. So I was just checking my fingers. Like I don't, my fingers feel a little weird, but I definitely, like it's not coming off at all. But look at this nice piece of Howlite. Oh, it's even got a little sparkle to it. Look on the side. Or maybe it just picked up some sparkles from the, the packaging. But let's read about howlite and let's see these harder 
I will say to the company, if you're listening, it's harder to read this like yellow orange font on this off white card. I will say that the citrine card was much, much easier and clearer to read just for the company's knowledge, but that's fine. It's just, just could be my personal preference too. But here's Howlite. Howlite is an extremely calming stone that can help with insomnia and an overactive mind. Wow, I totally need Howlite in my life. When placed under a pillow, it is said to bring a better night's sleep to those with insomnia. When placed on the third eye, meaning the third eye chakra, it is said to bring past memories and emotions of our past life while getting rid of any past bad feelings. It helps dispel any negative thoughts, anger, or temper. It also helps remove any stagnant energy or emotions to bring oneself to a more positive place. Helps get rid of oneself's doubt, criticism, and pessimism, changing your viewpoint to a positive. Very cool. It's kind of neat. Like, these crystals, they, they tend to, a lot of them help manifest and support the same thing, let it, yet at the same time, some of them are unique and have individual properties. And I kind of wish these descriptions, not just from this company, but literally any crystal company or any crystal resource that you look at, I wish they would kind of just like highlight the main differences between each crystal. Like if both, um, which one did I say manifested love? I think the, um, the citrine and the rose quartz, if they both help with love, then what do you choose and when? I mean, I guess the rose, it, there are, diff there, there are nuances in the wording, but you really got to know your crystals. I guess that's what I'm saying. So that, I guess that means I have a lot more to learn. Um, so what do you, let me know what you guys think. Uh, thank you so much for Captivating Crystals for sending me these three to review and show with my wonderful subscribers. And let me guys know what you think of the box. Uh, I guess for my random comment, shout out question, it would be, um, what are your plans for Valentine's Day? And you can say you don't have any plans. I mean, you know, everyone's, not everyone's celebrating for sure. Um, but just let me know what your Valentine's Day plans are. And if you have any or whatever. And then, as always, if you have any comments, questions, I'd love to hear from you guys in the comments. You talk about crystals, you know, you can talk about, but talk about crystals with me at any time. Uh, so anyway, if you like this video and want to see more content about crystals or unboxings or essential oils, please hit that like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I would love to hear your comments below. Thank you so much for listening to me as I unboxed and showed you guys the valentine's day set plus extra crystals from the captivating crystal company and until next time i will catch you later